very soon sixth round will start um for a for an uh half out of uh, five i just won my game against sergey volkov yes but throughout the game uh, i wasn't playing well and he had uh, uh i think he equalized very easily and then i plundered uh, my pieces he could easily take rook b5 and he would have a much better position but he blundered his knight uh, by going knight before and after that i think more or less it was under my control i wasn't uh, really worse though it was complicated yes uh, didn't play well so the important thing we should start playing better chess that's our goal Yes, mainly doesn't um, matter whom I'm, whom you are playing. You should try to play as good as you can. So we see that uh, about ten players are having four and out, out of five. And uh, yes, I'm playing uh, GM from uh, Iceland. Yes, I, I never played him but i know him okay d4 knight f6 is good uh, theoretician as well uh, let's go d5 let's keep this check and he does go and let's go b6 i played uh, this line against uh, van valley Queen a4, bishop d6 is the move. Bonvalli took d5. It's a3, I can go bishop d6, bishop e7. Usually people are going, as I know. Yes, what will he play? b4, it's another move. b4 does look interesting. What should I do? Should I go just. Uh, he's maybe threatening some c5 stuff. Uh, a5, b5, bishop b7, does look interesting. Okay, let's go a5, let's go bishop b7, and later on we will see. Yes, and here, of course, my point was to, as soon as I can, to go c5 or c6. Let's say c5, fighting for the center. Not sure how good or how bad I'm playing. Yes, b takes c, I will take with the bishop. d takes c, I will, yes, c takes d, he goes. c takes d, should I take with the e pawn? I can actually, d takes c, but I like taking with the bishop. I like taking with the bishop. Yes, bishop takes, I will probably take with the queen. Yes, e4, he goes e4. I think we don't have much to think. Yes, e5, bishop g2, he takes f. This is known uh like bishop f1 we are war so knight d5 is the only move to play and what does my opponent want knight d4 i have always c4 ideas knight c4 he can go of course and i think yes d takes c goes i should take with the bishop i guess and why not uh, just going rook c8 and leaving leaving our bishop queen g4 he does go queen g4 let's retreat our bishop and also threaten some but am I really threatening it? I'm not sure that knight f6 might be there. Knight f6 might be there. Maybe I did not play well. But knight f6, at least I, I can go king h8 maybe. Yes, because knight f6, he takes f, and uh, bishop f6, bishop f6, bishop f6, he takes f. Yes, I should play king h8. I don't have anything else. I don't have anything else. 
fortunately or not i don't have bishop d5 bishop d5 yes i think we are not yes it is already dangerous for us yes do i threaten yes g takes f he takes f bishop f6 maybe i am threatening yes. that's why he's taking his time yes seven he goes wow wow king gets seven but what is happening if king gets seven he wants to go queen bishop e4 queen h5 or queen h5 bishop e4 g6 takes takes maybe maybe perpetual maybe not if i go f5 he takes f knight f5 f6 he will take bishop f6 but we have bishop e4 so let's see what is happening no but f5 he takes f5 is winning no f5 uh e takes f knight takes f6 uh bishop takes f6 bishop takes e4 bishop e7 takes queen g4 yes f5 should win i apologize my wife is knocking on door. yes i think this is winning for us so far bishop f6 bishop e4 like what should queen g4 isn't working bishop e7 queen e7 yeah surprisingly my opponent uh, blundered but relax Yes, bishop e4 was my point. Wow, and again I'm plundering some, some stuff or not. But what if queen e8 I play? Queen e8 is there, no? Queen e8, let's go queen e8. Yes, let's say taking here, taking on a3. Okay, how should I play? Maybe I did not play well, but okay, let's not, let's not panic. Should be better for us. And yes, we did win.